everyone, it's Danielle Taylor with Keller Williams Realty here on the beautiful Outer Banks. And it's our last stats day of 2023. We can all be merry, happy, jolly, um, as we talk about statistics, which is very exciting. Um, just a reminder that all the information as usual is courtesy of the Outer Banks Association of Realtors. And that is through November 30th, 2023. So let's dive in. Whee! Residential sales units, they are down 28% year to date. Um, and they are down about 15 and a half percent November over November. Okay, so our residential, residential sales units are down um, year to date. We've been seeing that pretty much as a trend all along. Um, looking back to 2019, because we've started doing that to sort of look pre-COVID, we are down about 15% year to date versus 2019. Okay, so that's sales units are down. That is a direct result of inventory issues. And we've been talking about those all year. So average monthly inventory year to date remains flat. So at, on average, we have about the same inventory this year over 2022. And it's down 72% versus where our average monthly was in 2019. So that gives you a sense if we're down only 15% in sales versus 2019, but we're down 72% of in inventory, we're definitely outpacing. So that's good to know. Um, and the strength of the market continues because 29% of the properties that uh, came on the market in November have already sold or gone under contract. Okay, so the, the demand is still there. That's, that's almost a third. Um, residential inventory was up though, 5.8% from October. So we, we did see it coming up and it did hit a 2023 high in November. So it is hitting a higher number with the inventory, um, but still nowhere near where we were back in 2019. Um, the rolling three-year average inventory, we're sitting about 26% above that. Okay, so overall inventory definitely on the rise. Um, but again, so far off 2019 that it's not even in the same round. Pricing. So the median residential sale price year to date is $550,000. And my statistic for that excludes co-ownerships because those can, can skew the pricing data. So just note that that excludes co-ownerships. Um, for residential, it's actually holding steady that 28% of the properties needed to do a price reduction year to date before they sold. Okay, so 28% have done a price reduction before selling. And those that did do a price reduction are selling at about an average of 89% of asking price versus those that did not do a price reduction and those are at 99. So that's a huge difference. So pricing it right from the beginning can really help you in the long run. Um, so that's really interesting for us to know and to watch. That's been pretty consistent all year. But in fact, that's down. The 89% is down from where it was last month when we were year to date. So good to know. <laughs> Days on market. So it is true that things are sitting longer. We're sitting um, at about 50 days on market average uh, versus uh, year to date, last year we were sitting at 23 and the median is 19 versus 12 last year. So definitely taking longer to sell. Um, one thing to note though, is that the average days on market for those homes that did a price reduction before they sold was 115 versus those that did not. And the average was 36. So not only are you getting um, a better dollar amount if you price it right from the beginning, you're also um, selling quicker. So good to know on that front. So for everyone that's joined us all year on this channel, um, you're used to the cattail. Um, thank you, thank you so much. And thank you for joining us for Stats Days and all the other videos. We love doing them. Jody and I really appreciate you watching and we look forward to continuing to bring you content in 2024. 
If you have any questions at any time, make sure you're reaching out to us. It doesn't matter how early you are in the buying or selling process. We're here to be your resource. So please reach out. We'd love to connect, love to talk to you. And we wish you a very healthy, happy, safe holiday season and a prosperous 2024. Have a wonderful holiday and um, we'll see you soon from the beach. Wee